Why is sexual harassment so pervasive and so hard to address? Let's interrogate the whole system. Hi, my name is Jody Cantor. I'm an investigative reporter for the New York Times. Where do you go? I was told that the wrongdoing in Hollywood is overwhelming. I don't want to be quoted. Period. Well, I said. In your previous stories. How did you persuade women to tell you what has happened to them? I think I'm made to them. I can't change what happened to you in the past. But together we may be able to help protect other people. The truth, basically. What is it exactly that we're looking at here? These young women walk into what they all have reason to believe were business meetings. I can still see it. The hotel was in the floor plan. He kept trying to touch me. I asked him to leave me alone. Instead, they say he met them with threats and sexual demands. I was young, scared. Hi. What's in the New York Times? I believe he used to work for Harvey Weinstein. We kill them every time. Harvey had an amendment to lose any allegation of assault. We kill these people. We will not do this. Will you give me just one chance to talk to them? Are you sure that this isn't just you? You want to sneak with a movie producer to try to get ahead? Think of the white people. This is about the system that protects the abuse. The women who receive these settlements, they can't speak out. So we see if they do. Someone who could speak freely about the payout. What payouts, John? Yeah. You have to imagine that every call you make has been recorded, and you can follow them. Can you imagine how many targets are on them? You want to get the kill. Do you wish you hadn't set up for the fire? Do you? No. The only way these women are going to go on the record is to stay on some step. We're all here, Harvey. So? Have you talked to? I've been to and I don't want them to ever accept 